Reality TV star Tato arrived in South Africa from Lesotho in her late teens. She's always cherished the dream of having her own wine label and has studied both marketing and winemaking in order to achieve this. Now, to both her family and industry veterans like Eric Sass, she's a respected connoisseur. Very welcome at Wolvenhoek Farm. Thank you. I'm going to take you guys into the cellar. We're going to taste and blend Babayeto. And then afterwards, we're going to the vineyard and we'll do some pruning. I'm super excited because I've only done harvesting. So I haven't done pruning. I haven't been hands on. So I would love to see what method do you have for us. Great. Let's go. To stay grounded, Tato keeps her mom, Matsepe Monse, and bestie Elaine Fleischmann close. And she'd invited them and her family with on this excursion to find out more about winemaking. My friendship with Elaine actually happened two years ago. I met him at the event and immediately when I saw Elaine, I fell in love with him. So that's how we met and we forged a real relationship. So Elaine is the love of my life. We met at an art exhibition, randomly. Her and I just struck up a conversation and we just fell in love with each other and it's been best friends ever since. My mom, my nieces, they're the love of my life and now that I'm here and I've got this platform, I feel like the only people that I need that I know that they're authentic, they're real, they're genuine and they're raw and they will tell me how it is, it's my family. So it's so important to have your family surrounding you because they will tell you how it is. Tato having come from such humble beginnings from Nosutu, she's got a massive, massive family and she loves absolutely every single one of them, from her nieces to her brothers, her mother, everyone. She absolutely holds them nearest and dearest and she treats her friends just like her family, which is what I love about her. We are from Lesotho and she takes us all around Cape Town to be here since she's the one who brought us here. We've known Cape Town because of her. She's the diva of the family. Yeah. Auntie Tato, I don't know where to start. She's beautiful, but then she's so funny and crazy at the same time. She's a good person. Yeah, you can have fun being around her. Before tasting success, Miss Monse had to rewrite matric, fund her studies, then learn about wine. One thing that I'm picking up is the color already. It's sure. darker than the previous one. Because it was fermented in French oak barrels. What we did with this wine, after pressing, we put it straight into oak barrels. And you let the fermentation go in the oak barrel. This one, when it's finished, will you will taste it has been in barrels, mm. but it's not going to be overpowering, and that's what we aim for. But Fiona here, she's going to be the next manager of the farm. She's now assistant manager, and we're prepping her, and I can go to Europe and sell wines. Yeah. So it's so nice for me to bring the next generation of winemakers and I feel like we need more female black women that are getting into the wine industry because our wine are really divine. Women empowerment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> women in wine. Cheers to women in wine. During her studies at the University of Stellenbosch and the Cape Wine Academy, Tato initially mastered small-scale production. She has a very DIY, hands-on approach to the science and is always keen to learn more. We are pruning now our W11 block. What we will do is we will cut more away so that you have less grapes, but you get better grapes. You leave two buds on the shoot. And if there's two shoots, the elder one goes and you leave the younger one. Mm. And what yeah. is very important is, you always need like a fist at least in between two shoots. Here a shoot, there a shoot. Not here a shoot and here a shoot. That's too close, then your, your crop gets too dense. Yeah. Mm. Mm. And if you have a too dense crop, you get diseases. Miss Monse has her own wine label, with the wines being made at the Orange River Cellar. 
a natural marketer with her own agency, her role on TV has seen sales boom. Shying away from a challenge is not in her DNA. Have you guys done this before? I've never. Chuma, I've, I've never. <laughs> I've jumped out of a plane, but I've never done. Have I've you never jumped run out of the plane? Oh, uh, yeah. plane. Uh. yeah, I've done skydiving. Oh, okay, but I've okay, never okay, run skydiving. starts to my death. Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 It's very important for us that the conditions are perfect uh, because we want to take the passengers on a non-forgettable experience and very safe environment. The passengers can uh, expect to see the beautiful views of Cape Town from a bird's eye perspective. Maybe a little too much perspective for fashion curator Kutazwa Ruxi Ekana. At first, Tato's rival on their reality TV show, but now her BFF. I've never paraglided before. It's my first time, but I am looking forward to it because sometimes we tend to run away from being scared. I mean, I don't want to say much, but I'm ready for it. <laughs> I've never, but I'm super excited. Seriously, this is something that I've been planning for such a long time. So right now, I'm all about adrenaline. I'm all about adventure. So this is up in my alley. A slightly rocky start has never gotten in Tato's way before, and she was soon up where only eagles dare. Take off was a little bit bumpy, but when we came down, I could see sea point and drifting. And it is the best experience ever. It was like out of body experience, and I will do it again and again. And if they need a pilot, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's quite scary. It needs someone who's bold, someone who is ready to, you know. Sure. Yeah. Were well, you not scared though? Mm. <laughs> As Tato tells it, get on her wrong side and you can expect an atom bomb. But as a friend, she's in your corner for life. Tato is probably the most real, authentic, and straight shooting friend that I know. She tells it like it is. She is always there to listen. She's just incredible. She's the warmest person I know. I love that she's fun. She's pretty. She's beautiful. And she take care for me. It is Lekka Baby Seer, but behind the postcard, it's taken extraordinary lengths to get here. To an industry dominated by men where black women winemakers are amongst the rarest of the rare, Tato has brought a genius for marketing her brand by outrageous and fun reality TV. It's been an amazing day and I'm looking forward to spend times like this with all of you, mom, my nieces and my best friend and my gay husband and I love you babes, I love you mom, I love you kids! Love you too! <laughs> Get more of the Insider Essay online. Follow, connect, engage and be inspired to live better with the Insider Essay. Watch the show Monday evenings at 6, repeat Saturday at 1 on S3.